Good morning, everyone. It's Dr. Cahan here with Dr. Kestenbaum, our fellow that started in July at the Cahan Center. And what we're going to do today is we're going to demonstrate how we utilize Stick It To Me to perform a cervical facet injection. Dr. Kestenbaum has been doing lumbar injections and has advanced to cervical injections in four months by practicing on this model while he has free time in the office. So we're going to get ready to go, so just stay tuned. Hi, I'm Dr. Kestenbaum. I'm a fellow here at the Cahan Center, and today I'm going to be showing you all how to do a cervical facet injection. Dr. Cahan would be so kind, he's actually going to be my fluoro tech for this procedure. <laughs> so the first thing we want to do is make sure our spinous processes are lined up midline. Let's see, let's get a picture there. And then we want to make sure, now that we're midline, we want to make sure our incident processes are uh, all lined up and that looks good and so now we're going to get our facet joint lined up so we can get it nice and open. So to line up the facet joints we're going to go caudally until we see that facet joint opening up on the right hand side of the screen. It looks great to me. Alright, we got our pointer here. We're going to go right about there. Let your patient know we're going to feel a little poke. Poke. You want to make sure you're lined up with your beam there, with your hub over needle tip. We'll see how that looks. We're a little bit lateral, so what we can do is we can either come back and adjust a little bit and make sure it's right over it, and that looks much better. So now what we'll do is we're going to turn our notch up and head down. See how that looks because that should be getting our hub over our needle tip. We'll keep on that trajectory. Turn it up and head up toward that joint. Right there, I've contacted bone. You'll probably hear your patient give you a little verbal feedback, and there is where you would take out your stylet and you would inject. And what do we remember about bone? Bone is your buddy. Bone's your buddy. If you're contacting bone, you're in the safe zone, you're not around any type of vital structures. If we need to fine tune this, uh, we would rotate the needle 180 degrees so that it's pointing with the needle tape facing upward and you're going to use your feel to feel that you slid inside the joint and that would be your cervical zygopophyseal interarticular facet joint injection and as Dr. Kestenbaum pointed out it's just a matter of practice and utilizing stick it to me to practice on your free time it enables you to do this uh, whenever you want anywhere no more reservations at some cadaver lab. No, definitely not. <laughs> Between patients, after patients, it's convenient. Convenient. Thanks. <laughs>